Hello and welcome back to Crazy Hank TV. Today we're going to do some fun facts about one of my favorite shows of all time, and I'm talking about Justified. Justified starring Timothy Oliphant. I love this show. I'm a huge Timothy Oliphant fan. I loved him in Deadwood. Of course, I loved him in Justified and a lot of other shows. So, I was hooked on Justified five minutes into the pilot episode, uh, Fire in the Hole. That scene where he ends up shooting Thomas Buckley, he gave him 24 hours to leave town, but Buckley said, no, I'm not leaving, man. I'm not leaving. But in the restaurant, Buckley draws on him. And of course, Raylan shoots him because no one's quicker than Raylan. And it, the shot was justified. There's the title of the series. Um, so many great characters over the years that have appeared in Justified. Uh, probably the best bad person, Margot Martindale, who played Mags Bennett. Outstanding. If Season two might be my favorite season of Justified. I love all the seasons. But season two just had something special. I think it starts with Margot Martindale, who played Mags Bennett. She was just perfect. She wasn't over the top. She'd give you that Southern charm when she was trying to get you to go her way. But if you crossed her, she would do you some harm. Just a perfect season, and she deserved it, the Emmy that she won. Something that always bothered me, though, is you have Winona left Raylan for Gary. Now, nothing personal against Gary, but let's take a look at it. You got Winona. You got Raylan and then Gary. Now, sh you look at the two, you look at Raylan and Winona, it's almost like they're the perfect couple, Barbie and Ken. And you got Gary there. N nothing against Gary. He's not, he's not He's not homely, but he's he's not Raylan. So did Winona leave Raylan because she wanted something safer? But it turned out he wasn't safer, was he? Gary was a bit of a con man. She did get a nice house out of it. 17 actors from Deadwood appeared in Justified. I swear I thought it was more. But it's 17 actors from Deadwood appeared in the show Justified. At one point I said, because I wanted a movie so bad, I said, why don't they just get all the actors to do a, like a crossover and we could have the conclusion of Deadwood then. Raylan killed 24 people. That was his kill count. Boyd Crowder killed 17. So Raylan is the champion of killing people on Justified. Nick Searcy was the first choice to play Art Mullen. When I read Elmore's story, Fire in the Hole, I got the character of Art Mullen. I just knew it would be Nick Searcy, Yost told. Walton Goggins had to be convinced to play Boyd Crowder. He didn't want to play him. He was from Georgia, and he didn't want to be typecast as a racist Southern boy. Uh, so there you go. He had to be convinced to play Boyd Crowder. Boyd was not supposed to survive the first episode. It's hard to imagine Justified without Boyd Crowder, and he really is. I mean, he, he does work so well off uh, Raylan Givens. They, they're perfect together. They work great together. I'm glad that they decided to keep him around. But they liked his work so much that they decided to keep him alive, and I'm glad they did. It just it worked out great. You can buy your very own Raylan hat. I didn't know this. It's a replica of uh, Raylan's hat can be yours for the price of $144.95 on FX online shop. So there you go. If you want to be Raylan Gibbons, kind of like Dewey Crow did, you can buy the hat online. Timothy Oliphant claims to be doing his best Sam Elliott impression. In order to be the coolest guy in the room, Oliphant claims that he just acts as Sam Elliott might. The irony, of course, is Elliott will star as one of the final season bad guys. So there you go. He's doing Sam Elliott. Nice. So there you go. There's some fun facts about Justified. Again, it's a show I think everyone should watch. Hit the subscribe button. Tell a friend. Share this video. Hit the little bell to indicate our next show that's coming up. And that's all I got. I'm out. Thanks for watching. Bye.